Oh my gosh. Oh my god. This is gonna be sick. Okay, I gotta say this. When was the last time you saw a Mishima Grand Finals? How many Tekken I, games ago? I don't remember. I don't remember. I think I was only a wee lad. This oh. is legendary. Two Korean legends going at it. Devil Jin versus Devil Jin. Devil Jin versus Devil Jin. And we saw we saw Nii's Devil Jin back at them in Germany last week, and it was super, super aggressive and, and really on point. We saw it earlier in the Tekken World Tour, the first event of the season, the final round where he decimated JDCR with Devil Jin. So, wow, Woo. this is such a treat. I did not think we are going to see this. Two masters of the craft, two Mishima legends, Nii versus Kudans. Let's go! Let's Grand get Finals! Get Let's get it, lads! The mirror match as well on the party stage. Couldn't have written a better story. Oh yeah, so Rock's Dragon Knee on the first player side. And Kudan's on the second player side. Nice, gets the Wasani Dude opting to go for the big damage oh, right away. Breaks nasty. the floor with the Heaven's Gate. That is nasty damage. Oh my gosh, and he got that. He goes with the laser afterwards. Look at this. <laughs> nice jab, jabbing him out of that board four. Is he going to go downstairs? No, it's, it's okay. He's going to keep it. You know, much like many of the previous matches that involved Devil Jin, I think it's really going to come down to the use. Man, the, he went for the real punish. It's going to come down to the use of the Hell Sweep and who's going to land it and who's not going to land it in the yeah. matchup. And Nii blocking the Hell Sweep there. Wavu, Wavu, Wavu. First round to Nii. Yeah, and you saw, you know, the reaction from Gudans when uh, Nii picked Devil Jin. He smiled. He <laughs> smiled. Because, you know, this is a matchup where he came from the era where he played against all the Mishimas. This is when everyone used Mishimas. Yeah. So we'll see how this is going to play out. Of course, he has him near the wall again. Up one four. Okay, couldn't really start in that situation because of the wall. Yeah, the wall kind of messes it up too. And that really is a mind game in and out of itself is do you try to make the side step? Do you try to squeak out of there? Yeah. Because, you know, the potential for damage, if you do sidestep it, you, you get a free, a free launch. Free launch, yeah, absolutely. These guys are just throwing out electrics, trying to catch each other coming in. Oh, Ooh. the Mishima resurgence. It starts now. Pushing at the wall. Is he going downstairs? No, he Ooh. misses the Thunder God Fist. Here you go. Of course, the full Hell Sweep is a launch on this stage. Oh, man, nice adjustment. Goes downstairs. Final yeah. flow. Goes for the Steel Pedal. Oh, nice sidestep. Unable to get it. Oh, he goes back and he gets wow, it. Wow, Nii taking it to Kudans with Devil Jin. Two rounds up. This is only the first of many matches that we're going to potentially have here, but man, already super exciting. Yeah, like like you said earlier, Nii in the loser side has to win two first to threes here. So we have a lot of tech coming up. Yeah, both of these. A lot of players, I think a lot of people out there consider Devil Jin overall the number one character in the game. Yeah. It's been said time and again. But man, in tournament play, a lot of these guys were afraid to use Devil Jin at first just because of, you know, the natural landscape of the of the game. Yeah, there is a barrier of execution there that's required. Oh, nice nice step. Oh, he was side enough to get that one, two, three. That was sick. And an extra back four as well. Big damage. Wavy, wavy. Nice. Wavy. Down back two, able to crush. Using that jab as a check. And that's the thing too. You look. It looks like these guys. You know, they're moving. They're dashing around. They're trying to find those openings. And the thing is, all these new moves complement. I mean, the traditional Mishima stuff that you see, the health suit, the electric wing god fist. But you got to consider the raid kick, the demon paw. All these things come into play. Yeah. So many options. It's all about how you use those tools. Down back two, catching knee, stepping left. A lot of these moves. Like you ha he has options to beat. The sidestep left, which is considered to be Devil Jin's weak side, but nice counter yeah. down, uh, down. Traditionally, down sidestepping towards the left is the weak side of the Mishima. So you guys are going to see these guys circling around each other a lot. They're going to be going clockwise. They're, they're going, <laughs> oh, I should say counterclockwise. They're going back in time. Yeah. And we are back in time because, man, these yeah. old guys are still here. <laughs> oh, just ducking in his face right now. Oh, got him with the extended health sweep. The follow-up. Oh, oh, but short of the wall. Yeah, misjudged it. And health, health sweep of his own. Yep, the other way. What's he going to do with it? Gets a decent amount of damage there, but now time's a wasting. Yeah, time is a wasting. There's only 15 seconds left on the clock. Who is going to take this round? You gotta be ballsy. Remember, you gotta live and die by the hell sweep. Gotta risk it for the biscuit. Who There's wants a to huge sit? pillar in the middle of the stage. Get out of there. <laughs> Four seconds left. Not enough time. Oh, the side roll. Oh, man. Knee able to scum it out there. First match to him. That was super clutch and very, very clever from Knee. Yeah, I like what I'm seeing so far, but man. Devil no Jin one. versus Devil Jin. Did not expect this. The mirror match. That is crazy. And Ni being up one as well. Kudans. And we know Kudans is not going to pick any different character. Now this is going to be as classic as you can get. Mishima versus Mishima. No walls. No walls. Oh boy. Guys in the crowd, are you awake? Make some noise. Good to hear. Because this match is hype. The mirror match in Grand Finals. Thank you.
Now, we saw we started seeing the movements, you know, the, we were talking about the inherent weakness of the Machimas being able to sidestep left. But I think what's really tough in this matchup is if you want to maximize your potential, you got to be able to sidestep an electric god, like in the, in, like, in an instant. Yeah. And that's something that we really haven't seen so far yet, is the ability for the other player to duck the Electric Godfist and fully get that punish. They're yeah. really testing each other a lot with the mids and the quick lows. And the timing, they're changing the timing constantly, so it's very hard for oh, them yeah. to do that. And sometimes, you know, the slight hesitation, like, oh, he's not going to do anything, then the flinch, and then out of nowhere, the yeah. Electric Wing Godfist comes out. Absolutely, yeah. And, timing and is so important. It, it, is, it is everything. Timing is everything. Here we go. Follow up goes with the go Dash Godfist. Hit again, about even on life. Yep. So close between these two. Legendary players. Yeah, we're seeing them using a lot of the down fours, the, the quick low kick, to kind of, you know, chip away at the opponent's life bar, kind of annoy them, and they finally create an opportunity for the Godfist. And there it is, just like you said, Mark. And me, looking wow. really, really strong here. Oh, yeah, he's looking Fun. super confident in this matchup right now. And I feel like this change and this adjustment, because he is such a lab monster, a scientist, he knows that this is the character he had to pick. He was able to watch those matches earlier yep. and kind of adjust and think about it for a while. These guys are just doing the same thing. They're like mirroring each other. Yeah, and that's the thing. These Both of these players come from the era where playing Devil Jin and using the machine was such a thing. So it, this yep. is like kind of ingrained in their DNA. Wow. Oh my gosh, there's the Godfist. Forward, 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 follow up. Goes for all the damage. Yeah, Neil looking very good here. Gets that. How is Kudos going to answer back? Yeah, able, able to stuff his electric there with the jab. Oh, oh, this time going the other way. And because it was counter it does a lot more damage. Broken plate. Oh, down forward one from me. Nice. Oh, he went for it. I don't know if he was trying to do the rage drive there, but doesn't matter. They're tied up on rounds again. And just like you said, using that down forward, not only just to poke away, but to also stop momentum from yeah. the opponent. It's you gotta, you gotta annoy him. And you know, eventually, they're <laughs> gonna try to react to the low, and when they do, that's when something's gonna come out. These guys are throwing out down forwards against each other. Yeah. So much. See, it's kind of sealed away the Wraith Kick, because you know the Wraith Kick is a bit slow, you can kind of float him out of it. They've yeah. been using so many jabs, but because the lows are coming out now, I think they're going to try to sidestep space it and then start going for the Wraith Kick yes. again. Oh, this time the low parry. Yeah, the low parry on that down four. That is the danger of using it too much. Yeah. Again, still just chopping away. This time using the Twin Lancer in conjunction there, starting to use the Wraith Kick again. Yeah, great block there. Oh, that health sweep. Unfortunately, no wall, so they're not going to have a lot of damage. Now, mix up. What's he going to do? Went for the steel pedal. Oh, again, chopping away. This time going for the mid. That's going to be punished. Yeah, nice. Tsunami kicks there from me, and he is two rounds up. Yeah, surprise, surprise. You know, this could be very big because, you know, right now, he's up 1 0. He could easily extend this to 2 0. That and if he crazy. does, if he does, he's closer to resetting the bracket. That would be crazy. Can you imagine that? A 3 0? A 3 0? Devil Jin versus Devil Jin? In the mirror match against Kudans. Nice. House sweep. Wow. Can he get full combo here? How's and he going to finish it? And you know, the thing is, in tournament play, we only see Devil Jin being used by Kudans, right? Yeah. But. He, a lot of people might not know he does have a number of other characters. Oh, okay. Well, Especially be, in the Mishima matchup, I feel like there might be a possibility he might switch. Wow, that would be very interesting. That would be a first in the second world tour, right? Yeah, it would be a first, especially for this player. Oh my gosh, and look at that. Three rounds to one. Knee is up 2-0 right now. I think this is where q Dance may have to think about changing characters. If indeed I don't think he he'll does do that. it until the reset. I don't think he would do it until the reset because he does, and you know, attack too. Do you know his team? Mm. He used Kazuya and Devil Jin. Ah, I and Kazuya, see. one of the characters that he actually has a pretty high rank with. So I'm okay. not sure if he would even consider it, but Kazuya, I feel, has a lot of tools that can deal with Devil Jin. I see, I see. I'm going back to the same stage. The I stage. can't believe this happened again. <laughs> you got to talk to someone, Mark. <sighs> Anyways, back into the matchup. Knee is in a confident position right now. Yeah, I mean, he, he has looked one step ahead of Kudans the entire way, timing wise, and even using those downfalls. I don't know. Let's see if Kudans can bring it back, though. Yeah, this is very a big turn of events, you know. I mean, I did not expect this at all. I mean, Ni always does that toss. Round always yeah, he does, does the unexpected. Fight. Nice down forward two to open it up here. This time, starting with a broken plate. They're going back and forth. Who's gonna go? Jab, right. jab. I have a feeling we're gonna see those low kicks again. They're gonna come into play. Yeah, I'm seeing Kudan just wavy, wavy, we're trying to realign himself with me. Nice twitch duck on that electric, but no punish. And that's the thing too, you know, that this the play style, the, the, the constant low kicks is something that he doesn't like. He doesn't like to duck. He doesn't like to react to that kind of stuff. But yeah. more often than not, we've seen in this year's Tekken World Tour, he's starting to buffer low parry when he's playing now. Yeah. So this is like a different version of knee that we've seen from previous years. And it has been paying dividends from as well. So down 4-2 counter hit. It's going to be some good damage. 
Yep, dashing electric. Follow up there. Demon Steel pedal close enough to get the hit again. again. Wow. Oh, the oh. rain kick at the follow up. That's going to be it. First round to Knee. Wow, Q Dad looks so good in that round, and Knee just stole it from him. Yeah, all it takes is, you know, a few mistakes here. You know, the Mishimas, especially Devil Jin himself, he can capitalize on, on whiffs and mistakes. Interesting to see that Knee using a lot of down forward too with uh, Devil Jin. Maybe an underrated move of his. Oh, it's definitely underrated. It's. it's even if you do it on accident, it's one of the best options that he has. <laughs> yeah. It's safe, it gets you a combo on counter hits. Like, I mean, oh, you got some my electric? Hey, you go, hold this. Right. Oh, gosh, nice gun is there. Stops the momentum that Kudan's had. Finishes it with electric as well for the Okizemi, oh, catches the duck in. The classic while standing two into the Heaven's Gate follow up. That has to kill at his confidence right there. Oh. Wow. A great option there as well, using that while standing two because it tracks to Dragon Jin's weak side. Um, and yeah, this is kind of crazy because he's one round away from resetting the bracket. And this is like uncontested, pretty much. This is crazy. But Kudan's fighting back now, trying to wave broken plate. What a duck there! I can't believe he done that. And an electric from me himself as well. Yeah, Look at this damage. Obviously, smelling blood right now. He's taking risks because he's taking liberties to duck when he doesn't need to. Yep. He had to leave, but right now it's close here. Potential third round. Oh Might my. be a three round straight. Who knows? Oh, nice wall standing one, two. Oh, oh he got my him. God. He didn't even need to do that, but he did. After getting hit, he goes in with the electric and finishes it with the Rage Art. There we go. Wow, so we have ourselves a reset. Knee has reset the bracket now. Both players in the loser's side. And it's all going to come down to this. A race to three. And a not race only that, to three. but in 3-0 in the mirror. Who could have predicted that? Yeah, something unexpected. So it's a brand new set. And oh my god, Are three in a row. Are you serious? We are back in the infinite stage, Arctic Snowfall. <laughs> oh my god. And no character change from Kudans. Going to stick it with Devil Jin. It's all going to come down to this. Here we go. Guys. This now is our grand finals. The final set, guys. Knee versus Kudans. Devil Jin versus Devil Jin. Let's go. Oh boy. What is Kudans going to do, Mark? 3 0. I have a feeling he has set. something up his sleeve. I have a feeling there's. Obviously, he's a Devil Jin Master. There's a lot of things that we haven't seen from him yet. I have a feeling he's going to start getting desperate and start employing new tactics here in the matchup. He's definitely... He's had time now to to, to look at Nii's Devil Jin and figure out what he can do. Yeah. Of course, that's the advantage of being in the winner's side of Grand Finals. You have a lot more time to adapt. Nii's ducking a lot. He blocked two broken plates in a row. And, you know, it's just that deep level mind game. Like you said, these guys have been playing since Tekken 5. You know, maybe they know something about each other. Yeah. And you know Nii, of course, I mean, he's played against Kudans for so many years, and Kudans has only used really Devil Jin in tournament play. Yeah. Nice. Those town fours, I don't think I've seen this many town fours this whole weekend. Yeah. They're chipping away. They're trying to create more opportunities for the bigger moves to hit. Yeah. Nice. And Kudans fighting back here. He might be able to get around because he did not get around in that last uh, matchup. All these rounds are going right to the end. Only 12 seconds left on the clock. Yeah, no time left, but he does. Oh, he hit him with a raid kick to follow up. What's he going to do afterwards? While standing four and knee, continuing his dominance here. Wow. And Oof. now, finally having the lead here. After such a mollywop in that first set that they played when he picked Paul, knee finally at comeback point. And he's finding, finding a lot of success with those electrics as well. And oh. the health sweep. They're flowing, they're starting to go in. And Kudans, man, he's going to have to make adjustments, otherwise he's just going to be down here. Oh my here. god! And Kudans tasting some of his own medicine! And who knows? Who, knew, who expected this to happen? This is such a textbook style of Mishima, where you're mixing it up. Hell sweep. Mix-ups goes for the mid. And it's all working out right now. Okay, nice from Kudans. Oh, oh Fighting back. Yeah, nice whiff punish there. Big damage. Nice, the delay there went for the laser scraper. Of course, we're not seeing as many health sweeps from Kudans. Of course, like you said, Nii is ducking quite a lot. While sending two. Oh, boy! Nice, he went for the damage here at Nii. Feeling himself. Electric, like you said like you said before, we're in a power plant. Electricity is flowing. Nice, Twin Lancer. Broken plate. You know, Kudans has the slight lead here, but he can't afford to go down. Man. Not after he had so much momentum going into the grand final. Oh, wow, oh. what a step back dash. Yeah. Into the follow up, gets the God Fist, it closes it out. Kudans finally winning a round. Yeah, Come finally on. with the life feed. We've had Kudans with the life feed a lot of the times, but Nee's always brought it back. Oh, now going, giving him a taste of his own medicine. Yep. Starting to flow with the Mishima style. Oh, counter hit. Counter hit back four, let's see what the combo does. Electric, yes, what's the Oki? Nice, goes for the Demon while this time going for the mids, opting for the safer options. Yeah, trying to catch Kudans ducking. Up four, four. No success, no success. 
And that's the thing too, is it's gonna just keep whittling away at you. I mean, a lot of these pressure strings, the down forward one, two, the delays in between, yeah. you're gonna have to be aware the entire time. And you can't play as sharp as you can the entire time. There's gonna be moments where you falter. Exactly, and you have to take advantage of those times. Have you go, knee one round away. The rate hit. Oh, and the God Fist lands, and look at that. The first match goes to Knee, and Kudans is now put in a situation where he's at the disadvantage. Knee, yeah, taking this, the, taking the lead in this set. I just think Knee's timing right now is, is superior. Oh yeah, it's working out. He has been in control of the matches. You guys have seen it. I mean, he has won. Are oh. you serious? Kudans, he doesn't know what to think. This is why this stage is banned when you do bets. Stage this is bets. unprecedented. How many times? Did <laughs> this is four in a row now. What's going on? We can't get away from the Russians. <laughs> All right. It's cold in here. Yeah. Is it snowing outside? All of a sudden, this has got really cold. Here we go. Kudans, of course, not happy with that from his reaction. What are the statistical odds of that? I don't know. I'm done with that 50-50 joke. I, I, I'm serious here. This is kind of crazy. It's, it's kind of scary, man. But anyways, Knee is up 1-0 right now. Has the lead in the tournament. Like to see Kudans try to break down Knee. But Knee could be too solid. Here we go. All right, here we go. Gets a nice counter at Electric Pin Godfist. Look at the damage here. Looking for the slash kick. Trying to create that pressure opportunity. They trade with the wall setting too. Very nice. Oh, good luck. Oh, and a great punish there. Able to block the health sweep in time. There you go, and Kudans. Kudans, yeah. Maybe Fine that's what he needed. Fun. Yeah, definitely. He definitely needs to get himself a match on the board for Momentum. You know, Momentum is huge in these situations. Yeah. High pressure and, situations. And that's the thing too, is if he loses this next matchup, he's gonna have he's gonna have to win three straight matches, and that's a tall order for anybody against Nia. And it's probably gonna be on this stage again. Oh gosh. <laughs> Alright, a lot of jabs, jabs. Uh oh, and now D switching it up, using the standing jab to create space. A bit different from what he was using when he was using the low kick. Yeah. Changing up a little bit. Good side step. And that's the beauty of it all. I mean, these guys are using the most basic of moves, the quick pokes to try to create a storyline around what they're using in their arsenal. It's pure fundamental second there. Nice push duck into the 1-1-2. One, one, uh oh, got the whiff. Got to be careful. Yep. Oh, nice sidestep. Nice. Oh, the one, one, two. Shining fist combo here. Looking to close it out into the 1-2. Trying nice. to catch him sidestepping. Yeah. Kudans looking very strong in this match. I yeah, the, like the jab can be really good uh, at certain ranges to even hit him out of health sweep. Health sweep doesn't have the high crush, the high crushing uh, at all frames. Yeah, so I feel like you know he's kind of focusing more. If you look at the way Kudans is starting to do his dashes now, he's kind of like duck checking, trying to find that opportunity. Yeah. Look, he's playing way more methodical too. He's sidestepping, he's pausing, he's waiting, trying to see the reaction from Nii. Definitely. I don't think you should mind really getting hit by that downpour either. Yeah, the downpour is nothing. It's all about getting hit by the launches. Absolutely. Now he's trying to stagger his attacks as well. He's doing different different things, and you know the use of the first hit of the laser scraper in the laser cannon mix-up yeah. is actually really, really strong because it can catch double gin if he's trying to sidestep. Absolutely, the tracking is good on it. Kudans now with a healthy life lead hit. Only thing you can't do is get hit by a health sweep or an electric. Yeah, he's gonna have to be very careful. Obviously, these players both want that, but obviously you can't react to uh, an electric from Goffis. It's just way too fast. It's way too fast. There's 10 seconds left in the top here. One, one, two, oh, very nice. He has the lead, and look at, man, Kudans is looking really strong here. No. Has an opportunity, he goes into the Rage Art. He might have the slight life advantage here, but there's only four seconds left. Let's see what Kudans is gonna do and how he's gonna deal with this. Very, very good from me. That's oh, no, he art. still has the lead. He could, he, is he gonna run? That's the thing. Oh, one, two, four. That was brilliant. I can't believe he pulled yes. that off. Kudans with the composure and the clutch. With the insurance too. Usually the one twos will end with a high. Yeah. But he did the one two four. He was able to snuff it out. But man, that ended up hitting. So Kudans finally on the board. And we're going back to. Don't do it, guys. Oh, All right. Finally, yes. All right. The crowd's gonna go wild for that one. I know I am. <laughs> That was insane. All right, I had my email half written to you know who. <laughs> I was gonna let them know there's a bug in the system, but anyways, we're we're good again. We're good. We're good. We're Gucci, man. There we go. One one in this final set. Me versus Kudans, the mirror match of all things. Okay, now let's see what it's gonna be like now with with the walls. Yeah, how this gonna is gonna out. play out differently because man, I forgot what wall Tekken well, was like. <laughs> We pretty much played four straight games in the snow. Yeah, literally. There you go. Yeah, and this is going to play a huge factor because we were talking about, you know, the movement, the sides have left. Because walls are in play, once someone gets that positional advantage, it's going to be very, very difficult for them to get out. Exactly. It's yeah. all going to come down to the wall spacing. There's a lot more now to it. There's uh, 
No opportunity to backdash all you want. Sidestep and the Hellstream will do a lot more damage with Wolf. Oh yeah. And that's something that we really see, we really get to see uh, what they're going to shine in the way that Kudans especially is able to use the Hellstream and create the spacing with the wall and using the Demon Steel pedal as well. Absolutely. Yeah. Oh gosh, did you see that God was able to thread the needle here yeah. looking to close it out. Is it going to be enough though? Nope, the Oaks is going to be good for him. Nice, goes for the knee on the wall. 1-0 yeah, in rounds right now. Again, tied up 1-1 apiece on matches. Okay, hits him out of that electric. Yeah, he caught him out of it. Nice sidestep, able to get out of it. Down forward, one, two, one, kind of hit. Down four, chip it away, chip it away. Such a methodical approach to this matchup. You know, Mishima matches is, you know, it's a lost art form. Yeah. It's great to see. There you go. This is what we were talking about. No ball. Yeah, he's got to be careful. And now he gets a combo as well because he is right by the wall. And this is great positioning. He gets the wall again. Oh, nice. Now mix up. What's he going to do? Okay, jab, jabs. Oh, the hell sweep. in a really weird predicament there. Able to pull out the hell sweep. Yeah, and also gets himself out the wall as well. Uh oh, oh, he gets it. He gets the follow up here. Is he going to push towards the wall? No, doesn't get the follow up. Drop the combo. Hell oh, sweep. Oh, man. And the hell sweep landed. That might be it. And delay, no, he didn't delay it. But he gets the round anyway. Knee with the comeback. Yeah, that was great stuff. And you know, that was big. And he landed two uncontested health sweeps there. And that's the thing, you have to bend it. You, I mean, you to remember, you, you get blocked on your health sweep. You're getting launched no matter what. 100%. So the fact that he had enough confidence to risk it there was insane. Yeah, he had a massive life deficit. He had to do something. So yeah. Yeah. That's definitely going to make Kudans think now. Just two rounds down, not looking so good for him in this match. But he does have the life lead, so Kudan still fighting back. Oh, this time getting a low parry yeah. out of it. Finally, yeah. Doesn't get the follow-up. Probably should have went for the Demon Steel pedal afterwards. Oh, oh, nice! He's starting to duck, and I think that may be what he wants, though. Yeah, we'll see. Because we're going to start seeing the Wraith Kick. We're going to start seeing the Demon Fall. A lot more of that. Nice. 1-1-2 one, one, confirm on the board now, Kudan. 1-1. I think this is going to be big. I think this is really going to help decide what's going to happen because that momentum putting you into one more match to win the tournament is going to change everything. It's right now, so vital. if Nii gets this round, though, if Nii gets this round, it's going to be big trouble for Kudans. This round is so important. I want to see a final round. You want to see a final, final round. Final, final round, yeah. All right, he's chopping away, using the 1-1 one, one now, trying to get the confirmation there with the flash punch combo. Yeah, catching and stepping as well. Oh, there he caught him again. You know, the impatience there from Nii. That's the second time he got hit by the last hit of the laser cannon. Yeah, mixing it up really well. Now up to the back dash a bit more, using the wall standing four. Here's oh. the hell sweep again. We were talking about that. You got to live and die by the sword. And you're going to get the wall. Yes, but weird wall spot though. Not a big combo, but back for either way. Demon Seal pedal follow up again. Are we going to see the hell sweep? No, he ducks. 13 seconds left. He's gonna have to do something, but he does have access to Rage Art. They trade blows. Here we go now. Two down. Five seconds left. Nice. He has to do something. Oh, oh I can't believe he pulled it off there. The second, the delay there on the down forward one-two. Final round here in match number three. And a hell sweep from Kudan. This could go to the wall. Yeah, and Kudan's it will. Making this slow adjustment. You know, after he was down, he lost that early set very quickly to knee. But now he's on comeback road. Two steel pedals there for the combo and the hell sweep the wall. I nice. think he's sending a reminder to his old friend Nii. He's letting him know that he's the world champion. Yeah, Devil Jin is his character. There we go, the wall again. What a difference this wall has made. Oh man, it's helping out in a big way. And now, just like that, the Hell Sweep has been sealed away. And right now, Kudans is up 2-1 to one and one match away from winning the tournament. This is crazy, man. After losing 3-0. I, I think he's locked into Devil Jin. I think he went to stage select. Did he? Yeah, he did. Oh, so it's go. all going to come down to this. And Devil's Pit of all stages. What a perfect place. Guys, make some noise. This set is amazing. 2-1 for Kudans, bringing it back. Devil Jin versus Devil Jin in Devil's Pit. God damn. At least it's not the Arctic Snowfall, I'll tell you that. <laughs> wow, look at that. Concentrating really hard here. I think, I'm, I think we're going to see a final match, man. Oh man, <laughs> I don't want to lose it. I don't want to scream at the top of my lungs, but you might make me. You might make me. <laughs> Anyways, here we go. Let's see how this starts off. I think it's going to start off with a bang. Goes to the wall, standing 1-2. That's a bit safe. Oh, oh. it's in the LCB. He's not afraid. He's going to keep going for it. And again, remember, Kudans is up 2-1 right now. He's on the verge of winning this tournament. Can he do it after such a comeback and such a momentum-based shift from me? Exactly. But now he's working it. 
You know, Kudans hasn't been using a lot of health sweeps in the set. He's using that that mid a lot. I feel like you know the problem was because he did try using the health sweep in the last match, but they were blocked and punished each time. Yeah, now Nino ducking as much. Maybe it's time for the go to health sweeps. Yeah, it's it's been a chain reaction though. You know, Kudans he's not afraid. He's still going for the health sweep. He went for it there. He got jabbed right out of it. The initial starting frames of the health sweep are not ducking right away, so he's gonna have to be careful. Exactly, and that just demonstrates how strong a jab can be offensively and defensively. Kudans on the board. One round, two rounds away from winning. This master of here in Poland. Oh, but here we go. Runs into a god fist. Yeah, starting it off here. This is going to be big. He has the wall. Steel pedal. Follow up here. This time again, another block, oh, but he tried to go for the big punish. Yeah, didn't get it. And that's unfortunate because he probably threw away the opportunity to win this round. One, two, two. Oh, what a sidestep on the rate kick. And very nice. And this is going to be some good damage and some decent Oki as well. Doesn't get the steel pedal. But here we go. Knee. Gets the follow-up and gets the kill. Tied up on rounds. Oh boy. Oh boy. Fight. Oh, just throws him right out of that. Counter throw. Have you got plus frames? Goes for the low. Jab, jab. Okay, a lot of respect being shown by Kudan. Nice low parry there from Knee. That yeah. should go to the wall. And just like that, Knee is at the advantage here. Looking really good into the hell sweep again. The follow-up here. And yeah, good combo with this weird wall splat. Into the rain kick, the follow up here, broken plate, fighting back. Ooh, oh, no parry. No parry. There you go. Extra damage with the delay as well. He's going to chop away and gets the wall standing four. And look at that, two rounds to one. Mark, Knee are we going to get a final match? At the advantage. We might, and you might as well. Yeah. <laughs> if we're going to be here, we might as well get some good ass second all the way to the finals. Let's go. And we go, we're on a wall stage now, one of the only stages that transitions into a wall stage at the end. Let's see what adjustments can be made. Okay, no jabs. This time playing a bit more compact there while standing 1 2. Yeah, Goes for the down 4 2. He's trying to interrupt. He's trying to get. That's big. Oh. He pressed the button afterwards. He's walked right around him. Misses the god misc. But look at this. He's working a perfect right now. Looking to tie it up oh, here. Oh boy. Kudan making all the right reads. Uh oh, he gets the right kick. This could be the start of the end though. He's going to have to be careful. Okay, down 4 2. Nice, good confirm. I feel like he's using it more. He's going to be using that 1-1, one, one, trying to get that extra hit. Kudan's one hit away from making the final round. Yeah, he's going to have to be careful, though, because that 1-1 one, one does kind of lock him into place. If he whiffs that, he's going to get launched. Absolutely. Woo! Oh, boy. He could do it, and there it is. Tournament Tied up on rounds. Point. Tournament point here for Kudan. You are you, Kudan. Can he take it? Who's it going to be? Is it going to be the current number one, or is it going to be last year's number one? Who's going to take it? He goes for the health sweep. The classic, this is it, this is where it is. Either way, you gotta give it up. Both of these players playing out of their mind right now, trying to get that championship here. Oh god, finish it the string. Oh, he has it, one more hit can do it, and, and there, there it is! is. Kudans <laughs> takes it, his first tournament victory of the year on the Tekken World Tour, and man, what a performance for not only Kudans, but Ni as well. Wow, there he is, UYU Kudans, bows to the crowd. What a legend. He is back. Takes that trophy and he's going to be taking it home to South Korea, representing for the UIU team, Devil Jin. Wow, that's the story of the tournament. Devil Jin from both of these players.